Sometimes the decisions you will want your program to make have more than two possible outcomes. Let's continue our movie rating example, where we want to check whether the highest rating you can go see alone is an R-rated movie, a PG-13 movie, or just a G-rated movie. To check between these three different cases, we can add an else if statement. An else if statement is another condition that a program checks only if the previous if statements were false. So if age is greater than or equal to 17, write that user can see an R-rated movie alone. Else if the age is greater than or equal to 13, write that the user can see a PG-13 movie alone. Else, write that the user can see a G-rated movie alone. The else condition becomes the default condition because when all the previous if and else if statements are false, it will default to the else statement. Be careful as you construct longer sequences of else if statements. If you mix up the order, you might not get the behavior you intended. In our example, imagine we had switched the code so that the first condition checked if the user was old enough to see PG-13 movies, like this. This would mean that everyone who is 13 or older would be told they can only see PG-13 movies, even the adults. And with the next ELSIF line, the computer would be looking for people 17 or older in the remaining group. This code misses the adults because they were true in that first condition. This won't work. The computer checks the conditions from top to bottom, so it is important to enter the most specific condition first.